Something that's always out there in the back of my mind is, what if I can't do this? What if I can't be an individual? Meerkats live in groups of 20 or more. What if I, I can't separate myself from that? I just want to yell, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. I did that for six hours. Six hours of pleading for recognition. I got angry, frustrated. I tried to rage bite a snake. Serious doubt, questioning my own mere manatee. I thought about death. It really was a phenomenal moment. I mean, I know my strengths. I'm immune to scorpion venom, I have closable ears. I know my weaknesses. The alpha meerkat scent marked me. If I breed or have babies, the alpha meerkat's probably just gonna eat them or kick my pregnant wife out of the colony. I have closable ear holes. I'm sorry, did you say something? My ear holes were closed. I don't know. When I think about running with the group, I can't even pick myself out. I, I know the markings on our backs are as unique as fingerprints, but which one is me? All I see is a bunch of jerks with their tails up. We might as well all be named Timon. Hakuna Matata. More like, Hakuna, I don't matter. It's not so bad when I'm by myself. But I'm never by myself. God damn it, I hate being a meerkat. Hey, meerkat, open your ear holes all the way. You got a lot going for you. Every single day. You're like a diamond in the rough, full of tons of diamonds. The markings on your back scream out like sirens. Don't listen to those other ones that are popping up all around you. You just be yourself, and that is going to work out just fine for you. You're a special someone.